Now, if you fear at all that you're getting a false positive, which you might get the sense from experience that if things just go well so many times in a row with code, there must be something wrong, then what you can do is just go into your container.php file and just add some random characters and save it and then refresh in the browser and you should see an error. If you see an error, that means that we're using this container.php file and the only way that it would be working at this point is if it was properly loading in that YAML file. And you can muck up any of the YAML files so they'll throw an error just to make sure that you're pulling from them. It's important to have that confidence that you are actually editing the files that you're seeing being used in your project.